Talk of skirmishes between Scotland and England. You lost the town of Dunbar this week. Scottish defenders broke ranks and fled. The English have an army that is larger and better trained. To compete with them, we are going to need new recruits to pick up spear, sword, and bow. We must transform these shepherds into soldiers. Hey, 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 we're back with Age of Empires 2, the definitive edition. This is mission 3 of the William Wallace campaign. As requested, we are playing through the whole game. And I might return to AoE 3 and finish that off as well. But, um, go check out my last video on AoE 2. I explain a lot of things, including what I'm doing with walkthroughs and nostalgia gaming, new encounters, all that, whatnot. Oh, we will need yeah. many soldiers to defend our homeland. Oh. To win, yeah. you will need to create four militia. Oh, we'll yeah. start by creating villagers. Click your town center. Then click the create villager button in the lower left corner of the screen. Okay. I need to find a food it source. It takes time for the villager to appear. If your town center is selected, you can see the progress in the status area at the bottom of your screen. Yeah. Good job. The villager has appeared next to your town centre. Now, create another village. Here they are. You need additional housing to support your population. Already on a pal. Like a villager. Click the buildings button. Click the build house button. Then click where you want to build the house. I'd like to know where the berries are. another house. If more than one villager builds a building, it will go up faster. Each house supports five units. The population indicator at the top of the screen shows your current and supportable population. I guess we're not actually meant to find food. I'm guessing that's the case. Because, um, I cannot find food. Other buildings are made just like houses. Try building a barracks. The barracks is a military bill. Yeah, working on it, pal. Barracks complete. Now you can create soldiers. Click the barracks, then click the create militia button. Selecting different buildings or units gives you different options in the lower left corner of the screen. Right. Apparently we're just going to be the king of lumber camps. Because <laughs> why not, right? Create three more, and you will have enough soldiers to protect this area and win the scenario. Yeah. Click the barracks, and quickly click the Create Militia button three more times to make three soldiers in a row. No, don't tell me what to do. Have a look at them. God. The amount of detail that went into this was insane. I was a little... I remember being hesitant when it was first announced. I was like... Can they really, like, like, they're like, it's going to be 4K and all this really cool stuff. And I'm like, man, this game is old. Can they do that? Like, we all know how Warcraft Reforged was a fucking disaster. Now that you have a few soldiers, you will be able to defend this area against English attacks. Uh, am I? Right. Thank you all for watching. I hope you enjoyed that video. I'll see you next time. Goodbye for now. And don't forget to click those damn links. Welcome to the end of the video. Shout out to my lovely patrons. You keep the stream alive. Even a dollar per month is a lot of help and it goes a really long way. And thank you all for essentially getting me to this point. We've recently passed 500 subscribers. Woo. And yeah, this is... So I'm making a new outro. So we have a few Discord servers here we would like to show off. Um, this is my private Patreon Discord server. If you're a Patreon, you get access to this, depending on your level. But um, even $1 a month, you get that access to most stuff. Just like, uh, we've got videos, YouTube playlists, behind the scenes, which I just like generally drop stuff all the time. Quite nice behind the scenes stuff. Uh, we've got our main server here. 
And um, once again, links to pretty much everything. Co owned with Nadaline. So we've got news, wool mod content, other game content. Pretty much a bit of everything for everyone. And don't and forget to go look at my social media. I'm very active on all of them. There should be some screenshots popping up, but yeah, go check them out. Thank you all for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video. Goodbye for now.